Hi there and welcome to our next video on kinetic energy. This is a continuation from our last video, but in this video we're going to be looking at some exam questions. So let's get started. Our first exam question states, the faster a car goes, the more kinetic energy it has in its kinetic store. The kinetic energy of a car was 980 kilojoules when travelling at 35 miles per second. Calculate the total mass of the car. Show clearly how you work out your answer and give the unit and it's worth five valuable marks. So let's write out our equation. We've got the kinetic energy equals 0 0.5 multiplied by the mass multiplied by the velocity squared. So we're given the total kinetic energy in kilojoules. So we need to convert that, which would be timesing by a thousand. So it would be 980 thousand joules so we have 980 one two three thousand uh, joules of kinetic energy equals 0 0.5 multiply the mass which we need to work out times the velocity which we're given 35 squared so let's type in what we have so far we have 0 0.5 multiplied by 35 squared that would give us 612.5 612.5 and now we have to divide this answer by 980,000 joules 612.5 we just type that into a calculator 980 1 2 3 divided by 612.5 that will give us an answer of 1006 and we know that this is going to be kilograms because that's what mass is measured in and that will be our final answer 1600 kilograms that is the mass of the car and that will give you five marks for your working out next question the mass of the cyclist is 80 kilograms the speed of the cyclist is 12 um, meters per second calculate the kinetic energy of the cyclist use the equation so we're given the equation over here so we just have to put in our numbers so we have 0 0.5 multiplied by the mass which is in kilograms so we don't have to convert anything multiplied by the speed 12 squared we just type this into our calculator 0 0.5 multiplied by 80 multiplied by 12 squared that would give us an answer of 5760 joules and that will be our answer which will get you two marks one for your working out and one for your actual answer next question which of the following has kinetic energy a book on a shelf a girl sprinting or a stretch spring so a book on a shelf is stationary uh, stationary so we know it's not gonna have any kinetic energy at all so we can cross that out a girl sprinting will have kinetic energy because there is movement and a stretch spring will not have kinetic energy because it will have elastic potential energy because it's being stretched so we know it's not going to be there and that will give you one mark for the correct answer a girl sprinting our final question a girl of mass 60 kilograms can sprint at 8 meters per second what is her kinetic energy so let's write our equation 0 0.5 multiplied by the mass multiplied by the velocity squared so we have 60 kilograms which is in the correct unit 0 0.5 multiplied by 60 kilograms multiplied by 8 meters per second which is also in the correct unit so we can do 8 squared typing that into a calculator 0 0.5 multiplied by 60 multiplied by 8 squared that will give you an answer of 1920 joules so we can tick off the correct answer and that will give you two marks one for the correct working out and one for the correct answer and that is it for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked it. And one last thing, please subscribe and hit the like button.